say now to him for a nice cool drink of beer over at the uh, canteen. Thanks, <laughs> my right up. Jack, that beer sounds yeah. grand to me. Uh, oh, 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 a new set oh, of beer is coming. Go on, let's get it. You know, you make me look forward to these visits. I have a wonderful time. Come on, Jack. Me, me, Miss Kitty, stand over one and walk so 
Dog Bolter consistently bites on the very thing we try to teach our natives. Respect for the white man. Yes, I know, I know. Uh, don't, don't let it upset you. Uh, I'd like to sit for him all. Ah, who have we seen? The British lion, eh, old chap? <laughs> I, I suppose you saw what just happened, eh? We did. All this begging money. I only pushed her a little. I had to to make her let go. And my blacks were starting and uh, I was afraid she might have fallen and hurt that baby, you know. Your concern for that baby was quite apparent. Oh, man. 
Get me a drink. Right you are, Gavney. Right you are. But damn this shut up. Shut up! <laughs> I'm not good enough for them tin soldiers, eh? Me, August Bolder, with more land and money than any man in East Africa. Why not? I could buy and sell the whole army. Did you hear me? Yeah, yeah, yes, sir. I, I heard you, sir. I could buy and sell every one of them. Yeah, yeah, yes, sir. I, I, I guess you're right, sir. You, you could buy anything with with your money, sir. What's that? I said, there is anything in the world you couldn't buy with all your money, sir. What do you think of him? Blimey, me, sir. Why, well, see, he's a real aristocrat. She's got quality. <laughs> Wouldn't those stiff-backed soldiers with the stuck-up smart women bow and scrape to her? A noble woman? That wouldn't they? I say they would, sir. Yes, Governor. Yeah. I make them bend up backs. Until me too. Take a cable gram at once. Yes, sir. In answer to your letter. I am leaving for Germany at once.
in that hand. Yeah. I can't wait to meet the lucky bridegroom. Think of it, sailing tonight. Oh, you're such a lucky girl. And how are all the beautiful ladies? You should not be here. My, my bride. Wonderful. Girls, my fiance, Herr Gottlieb. Glad to know you all. This is indeed a surprise. <laughs> I thought so. <laughs> Well, I want you all to come to my place in Africa. Oh, what a time you'll have. Really? Why, sure, I'm a king there. I got my plantation as big as Berlin. Sure, I got 2,000 blacks working for me. Some payroll, eh? And Frau Boldy, as mine wife, will be Queen of Neuposen. Pretty nice, eh? Well, when you get the money, you can buy the best. Come. Be rest a little, eh? Meine Frau, Frau August Boldy. <laughs> Please, if you don't mind, I'll go and I can get a little fresh air. Sure, I come too. I put on the other shoes, huh? Permit the gnädige Fräulein. Thank you. Oh, not at all. I have been hoping for an opportunity to speak to you, but you seem so abstracted. I do not know you. No. No, that is very true. And indeed, my, my action might seem uh, rather forward, 
if it were not for the fact that uh, we are related. Related? <laughs> well, yes, you see, according to the steamship company's advertisement, we are all one big family. <laughs> Will you, therefore, please allow me to present myself? Mayor von Reichen, returning to Africa to take over my command at uh, Neuport. Your destination, may I ask? Neuthausen. So. What a happy coincidence. I throw a kiss to fate. Is this your first visit to the dark continent? Yes, it is. Oh, I'm sure you will like it. has glamour, romance, uh, a mysterious intrigue that... You paint it so differently from the picture I see. Oh, no. You, you mean that uh, as a soldier I am a good painter, eh? One of our chief troubles there is a large fat pig, a two-legged pig. Unfortunately, he is on this boat to turn in now, and I am afraid he's coming over to speak to me. Well, well, well. <laughs> this is a great pleasure. Maya Van Ryden, my husband. So you're going to Night Posen too, eh? The old French, you know. Good night. You need to get far. Good night. Nice fellow. No, thank you. Well, here is to the bride. Uh, and to the groom, too. Ah, that's good wine. <laughs> well, oh, of course. Too much light. Why not? You're my wife, aren't you? Well? Yes, yes, I know. Oh. Maybe you think I'm not good enough for you. I paid the money, didn't I? Well? Yes. Would you go on with me to now, Poulsen? Maybe I'll never reach Lloyd Posen. Oh, so that's your idea, eh? Well, we see. Here. Give me locked up. And when I reach Lloyd Posen, I put a big bar on your door. But when I want you, all the locks in the world won't keep me out.
Garrison, I fold in this place. Very well. All right. Return to the barracks. Shows you what you can do with money. Come, my dear. You heard that he went home to get married. Gentlemen, I am giving a reception in honor of Frau Boldy Friday night. I'm sure you'll like to honor the bride and uh, welcome her to Neuposen. We are honored greatly. And accept. Our invitation. I thought so. You see? That's what they think of me. Yes. I see. Joe, where have you been? Oh, there, sir. Come on, help me. Yes, sir. Ah, uh, ships. It's close. Well, I guess it's worth it. Well, I forgot to tell you, Gavin, the, the orchestra has come. Yeah? They've come a thousand kilometers. It cost me plenty. Uh, but I waited a long time for tonight. Listen. Go down and see if the roast are cooking, or if the champagne is on ice. I want everything to the Queen's taste. Meine Liebe. Yes? I want to speak with you. Well, that's nice. But I want you to put on that gray one with the low back. 
You know, in the long train. So when those stiff back officers see you, they die of envy. <laughs> Very well. <laughs> I see you use the locker fixed for you in the daytime as well as in the night. Yes, I do. Hmm, that's good. I might remember sometime that you're my wife and, uh, well, you understand. Yes. I think we understand each other perfectly. That's right. Sure. That's why you better use the lock and, and keep it locked. Nine? <laughs> On bed of Madame Wish the flowers, please. It doesn't matter. Get a move on there. Put it over here. Put it over there. That's your idea. Say you. Put that tablecloth on there right now, understand? We are going to have company fit for the king, absolutely. Yo. Yes, sir. After the party when uh, all my fine friends have gone, I want you and all the other servants to leave the house. You understand me? Yes, sir. Frau Boldy and I want to be left alone. Yes, sir. Old Governor, sir. Poor Assam's daughter has been here every day, sir. She wants to see you, sir, and I can't drive her away, sir. I told you I didn't want to see that woman in the house anymore. Yeah. 
considerate thing we could do would be to take our leave. No, quite right, old chap. Come there. I quite agree. Yes, sir. 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 servants leaves the house. I want to be alone with her. I understand, Governor. I'll show him. I'll show everybody. Her too. Who is master here. to a room, I suppose, huh? Oh, I don't know, sir. I can't say, sir. Well, go and find out. Yes, sir. I cannot leave you like this. I will not. Oh! Oh, no. No. It is the natives. They are beginning their moon dance there. Won't you let me take you to see them? They are just close by. Perhaps it will help you to forget. Oh, forgive me. I should not have said that. I want to forget. Enjoy.
are very fortunate to be able to see them. It is the most sacred of their dance. I can't find her anywhere, sir. Did you see Van Ryden hanging around? Uh, yes, Governor. I always get what I want, don't I? <laughs> yes, Governor. That you do, Governor. She comes. Helen, there is something I must tell you. After tonight, I feel I have to. Please. Don't tell me now. You're the one who was too good for me, eh? Now listen to me. You're my wife. You understand? Mine. And what's mine, I don't let anyone else use. Wait a minute. You get a lesson to learn. belongs to me, carries my mark. Maya Van Rijn. Maya Van Rijn, pardon, sir. We have a message for the instructions to be delivered to you without delay.
Oh, I'm sorry. I must leave. Oh. But before I go, allow me to present you with this little souvenir. And the slightest pressure of the finger, it fires. We are leaving at once for the border.
Auf Wiedersehen. Hitch up my carriage. The fastest team I got. And get it out in front, quick. Leo, You're crazy. Leo, Pack my bags, quick. And put them out in the carriage. Yes, sir. Crying, eh? For your tin soldier. Well, you'll never see him again. Come on, we're going to get out of here. What do you mean? They're leaving. I'm sick and tired of this play marriage anyway. What Come are you on. talking about? Let go of me. My letter for you, Walter. Strikes me as how you might have to go to war, Governor. Huh? I'm not going. They can't make me go. Oh, they gone, huh? That's one thing your money could buy, Governor. Governor. Wait a minute. I've been waiting to tell you this for a long time. You're nothing but a dirty, low-down, bloody swine. What? Ah! Oh, we can all right, put him on the car. Come on, we can send him across the board. I'm not going with you. Let go of me. You're the lowest thing that ever lived. You contemptible coward. Coward, eh? Well, I'll remember you for that. Sorry to detain you. My own von Reiden wants to have you fitted for a uniform. Uniform? Herauf! Eintreten! Abteilung!
But Liebrecht, if you bring your supplies down here, the British hold that point. You will. My boy. It Hello? makes very little difference to the British army at this point. Yes. Or whether right. they're over here. No. We will get all Golden. our supplies through In. just the same. Great. It has danger. Send help at once. Natives in rebellion, burning farms. Liebrecht, you must get a detachment through to them. But we can't spare a detachment. But good God, man, you think our forces are outnumbered. Besides, the trails swarm with the British. Then I go alone, with your permission. Help me. The whole avenue. I can get through the jungle. But, good God, the jungles are alive with the savages. Good luck. Are we the same?
till you get the word of command.
And it's a long while since we've smoked a Piccadilly together, eh? Uh, yes. I could not leave my prisoner in better hands. 